First story. A very poor man lived with his wife. Oh Henry. One day, his wife, who had very long hair asked him to buy her a comb for her hair to grow well and to be well groomed. The man felt very sorry and said no. He explained that he did not even have enough money to fix the strap of his watch he had just broken. She did not insist on her request. The man went to work and passed by a watch shop, sold his damaged watch at a low price and went to buy a comb for his wife. He came home in the evening with the comb in his hand, ready to give to his wife. He was surprised when he saw his wife with a very short haircut. She had sold her hair and was holding a new watch band. Tears flowed simultaneously from their eyes, not for the futility of their actions, but for the reciprocity of their love. Second story. Love and time. Once upon a time, there was an island where all the feelings lived happiness, sadness, knowledge, and all of the others, including love. One day it was announced to the feelings that the island would sink, so all constructed boats and left. Except for love. Love was the only one who stayed. Love wanted to hold out until the last possible moment. When the island had almost sunk, love decided to ask for help. Richness was passing by love in a grand boat. Love said, Richness, can you take me with you? Richness answered, No, I can't. There is a lot of gold and silver in my boat. There is no place here for you. Love decided to ask Vanity who was also passing by in a beautiful vessel. Vanity, please help me. I can't help you, love. You are all wet and might damage my boat, Vanity answered. Sadness was close by so Love asked, Sadness, let me go with you. Oh. Love, I am so sad that I need to be by myself. Happiness passed by Love, too, but she was so happy that she did not even hear when Love called her. Suddenly, there was a voice, Come, Love, I will take you. It was an elder. So blessed and overjoyed, Love even forgot to ask the elder where they were going. When they arrived at dry land, the elder went her own way. Realizing how much was owed the elder, Love asked Knowledge, another elder, who helped me. It was Time, Knowledge answered. Time, asked Love. But why did Time help me? Knowledge smiled with deep wisdom and answered, because only time is capable of understanding how valuable love is.